I wanted to stay uh -huh. naively, uh -huh. you know. Uh -huh. So, so in that sense, we've been involved in Africa, but not, uh -huh. you know, as, and, as and part and of real, any, yeah, a colonial power. What we do. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Very so, good. so in a way, we are more of an independent arbiter, okay. more acceptable uh -huh. probably to some people than, the, the, than okay, those who've yeah, been colonial right, powers before, yeah. who still have vested interest That's right. uh -huh. in what is happening in those countries. Okay. You know, for example, I know that you know a lot of the French-speaking countries okay. always under pressure from France not to work with the United States because mm -hmm. of what they what they feel, uh -huh. you know, is U.S. attempts to uh, meddle, yeah. meddle in their spheres of influence. Uh -huh. Exactly. I, when, when the West African uh, economic community, ECOWAS, uh -huh. was being initiated by General Gowan in Nigeria uh -huh. in the early 70s, the, Fr the French wanted to block it. Uh -huh. Yeah, they kept, you know, telling the French countries, well, Nigeria wants to dominate you all. Uh -huh. But not thinking these are all the same Check. people who uh -huh. want to form a union for their own interests. Interest. And you uh -huh. are sitting in, in Paris telling them yeah, how not to, to uh, work uh -huh. with their own fellow brothers uh -huh. there. Uh -huh. Exactly. That has been the problem, even in the United Nations. Okay. Yeah. The, the, the French government pressures the French-speaking, you know, uh -huh. governments not to, to you know, to cooperate. To, exactly. Uh -huh. Cooperate in what uh -huh. is in the interest uh -huh. of, of the whole African uh -huh. continent uh -huh. because of the fear of, uh -huh. of, of you know, their economic interests. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. And so we have, we have that great advantage of not having been a colonial power and that we have really have a clean slate mm -hmm. that we could even make a regional approach that would not be suspect as it would probably be if, uh, if one of the other uh, countries were to make such an approach. Absolutely, and, yeah. and, and President Obama is better situated than uh -huh. any president in the world uh -huh. or any, and any past president oh, of the United oh, States right, to make an impact uh -huh. on the continent uh -huh. now because it will view him as a son uh -huh. of the continent. Uh -huh. And now that's what he means. That he is. Okay, that's what he means <coughs> because yeah. directly, he's directly linked to the continent, continent. not indirectly. Uh -huh. you know, uh -huh. he's from yeah, he didn't come over on a slave uh, ship exactly. and look back. But that's, yeah, that's yeah, correct. He's directly linked to eat in uh, blood, uh -huh. you know, mm -hmm. yeah, because so his, his father is from, from the low ethnic group in... in and and in, from in what I understand, when, whenever he makes an appearance in Hawaii, uh, in Africa, or whatever, lines are miles and miles long, everybody trying to get, as it was yesterday in, in, in Canada, mm -hmm. people are simply trying to get out to see him. And so he has a lot of prestige in terms of trying to deal with, the, with, with this specific kind of problem. Is that what we're saying here? Precisely, precisely. You know, he, he, he's in a position to 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 become a, a great transformational uh -huh. leader uh -huh. insofar as the continent of uh, Africa, Africa is concerned. concerned. Uh -huh. You know, you hear the, the, the phrase uh, trade, uh -huh. not aid. Uh -huh. Well, you know, the, what the problem is that you cannot have trade uh -huh. when the partners are in equal. Uh -huh. And that's, that's right. the okay. problem. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh -huh. So uh -huh. when, 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 when some of the Western countries are tired, uh -huh. you know, of helping African countries, yes, you know, okay. the colonial past, colonial powers, they say, well, trade, not aid. Uh -huh. But they forget that most of the continent was devastated the way it is today economically uh -huh. because That's of right. their own policies. Oh, That's right. Of uh -huh. taking, you know, economic All resources, resources from Africa without paying for That's it. That's right. Exactly. Uh -huh. So, so when, when some of the country, countries in Africa, start saying, well, we need a little help here and there, uh -huh. you know, even with our own crops. Uh -huh. Also, they say, oh, no, it's trade, not, not trade. Uh -huh. Okay? Uh -huh. Yeah, <laughs> that's, that's, it. that's that's it. That's been a good excuse that's for not doing exactly. anything, you but you can, not yeah. fill up, fulfill the responsibility, mm -hmm. the moral responsibilities that they should have. That's, should that's, that's correct, and, have. They, and they impose high tariffs uh -huh. on African products, so they can even come in, come in. Uh -huh. okay? You see, and flood the continent <laughs> with cheaper with cheap, business, uh -huh. you know, so... So you see that even the domestic market in Africa that's, uh, cannot function well. So that's one of uh, uh, one other, you know, economic diplomacy that the Obama administration uh, has to do. That's, it's, it's, it's that's sure. mercantilism. We used to call that mercantilism mm -hmm. when the colonies and the mother country, except, but that's the same thing that's going on now in yeah. reference to these countries. Exactly. So that uh -huh. should be an equal, uh -huh. you know. And so, and so over the last minute, uh, Dr. Mudu, uh, you, you're hopeful in terms of uh, the uh, presidency of uh, Barack Obama in terms of dealing with some of the issues that we've talked about here, that yeah. we've been talking about for the last 20 years here. Uh, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm very optimistic. Uh -huh. I'm very optimistic uh -huh. because I think uh, he has uh, some good folks in the uh -huh. National Security okay. Council who know about Africa uh -huh. and who've lived there. Uh -huh. You know, the Treasury Secretary, uh -huh. Gardner, lived in, uh -huh. in Africa. Uh -huh. And you have Susan Rice, the UN Ambassador, who uh -huh. was former Assistant Secretary of State uh -huh. in Africa, and, you know, 
So yeah. I think he has a good. So, so I'm, he's I'm got his Clinton also. Uh -huh. He also and knows so he's Africa got a good inner well. circle that know the truth about Africa. Exactly. And of course, Dr. Do, let me uh, thank you over the last 10 seconds for coming by and giving us that extra yeah. information. And let me encourage our audience to tune in again next week for another informative edition of Commons. Thank you and good morning.